I hope that this is blazing hot. Low that intro. Thank you for joining me today and also taking the time out of your busy day to watch my videos. I greatly appreciate you. Today, we have some ramen noodles. Let's get started. Known Shim Premium Shin Korean Black with beef bone broth. <laughs> and then on this side, it says spicy. <laughs> Boy, let's get eaten. Hopefully I'll be able to handle this. <laughs> I'm trying to use chopsticks again. And yes, in Japan, it's their custom to slurp their noodles. Let's take some of this broth. And I had to, um, I had to put some Sichuan fried gel in this as well. Try to get some more noodles. There you go. And then turn the chopsticks to the side. If you ever see somebody taking our chopsticks and pointing them straight up, that's a no-no. You don't do it. Take another bite. I don't think it's gonna be blazing hot. It's spicy, but not chili head level. There you go. This is what the noodles look like. And it's hot. Not, not pepper wise. There's this There's this ramen shop that I've always wanted to go to in um, Japan, but I got, but I forget the name of it. And it's supposed to be a challenge um, ramen. Wait, um, but with a lot of this Sichuan fried gel in it. But, with my condition now, I don't think that's going to be possible. The noodles. And this slurp. It's pretty good. Have a nice heat to it. But it's not chili head level. And I would rate this a 9 out of 10. Yes, a 9 out of 10. It's not, it's, it's hot, but it's not the heat that you expected.
I love ramen noodles and I like using top sticks. When I went when I went to China in 2018, 2019, there was no silverware whatsoever. You had to learn how to use chopsticks. And I already learned chopsticks before I went to um to China. It was a it was an amazing trip. Went to like um, the Great Wall. Went to uh, the flea market where you can negotiate your prices, but you've got to know some Chinese to do that. And my Chinese was so strong back then. Another bite. Went to the um, the Beijing Zoo, an aquarium, and they had this amazing tiger that was that was actually carved from out of stone. That that tiger, if you took him and 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 he stood up, he would stand up to like probably two stories high. It's, a, it's massive. Then I went to the, the aquarium. It was good, but wasn't for me. Then I went on a Chinese food tour. And that food tour was absolutely amazing. Had some um, jianbing guozi, which is a Chinese pancake. Um, had some Chinese dumplings. It's just a lot of food. And then we had some um, Sichuan gangwo, which means um, dry, dry. It's like a dry portion of. Um, Hot pot. Um, just absolutely delicious food. Let's take another slurp. Mmm, so good. Then, where else did I go? Oh, to the Great Wall of China, which was so hard to climb. Whew. The next, the next day, I couldn't do nothing. Mm -mm. It tore me apart going up to that great wall. Then went to a lot of um, Chinese shows, like a karate show and stuff like that. Then, where else did I go? Oh, the International Pro Tower in Shanghai. Went to Disney in Shanghai. Went to um, the um, Jade, the Jade, the Jade Temples, the Jade Buddha Temples in Shanghai. It was just an amazing. It was an amazing trip. Let's take another, take another bite out of this ramen. So good. Yeah, um, it's good. It's good visiting visiting China. And where else did I go? Um, I don't 
know. Where else did I go? The Beijing Zoo. Beijing Aquarium. Oh, the Shanghai Zoo and Shanghai um, Aquarium, which was awesome. And then a food tour. The food tour was, a, was amazing. And then went to, um, oh, and then went to the Temple of Heaven, which was amazing. And I think that's about it. 2019 was the last time I've been out of the country. Yep, haven't been out of the country since. Let's take another bite. Oh my goodness, I made a big mess. Well, it's gonna be the end of this video. Live life, love life, and I'd like to take you to the next level. Thank you for watching, and I'll catch you on my next video. Peace.